Hello everyone, this is Irfan Zardat Khan from Javelin Technologies bringing you the latest in SOLIDWORKS 2013. Uh, for today's session I will be showing you the compare feature which has been introduced to the flow simulation in 2013 SOLIDWORKS. So what this does is if you have multiple studies in the same um, for the same part which might be on multiple uh, um, configurations you can actually load up the results of the two configurations side by side it could be the same configuration with different flow setup uh, anyhow if you have two different studies could be different configurations could be different flow setup uh, you can compare the results of these two studies now so the way to compare the results would be go under the flow simulation menu under results you will see that there is a new compare option hit that it will ask you what is it that you want to compare so one option could be you want to compare the active scene or you want to compare the goal goals plot between and you choose what it will bring you all the projects stored in that file so before I go ahead what I will do is I will create a cut plot which shows me the temperature distribution in that region so let me go ahead and bring back that compare tool so under results compare so I will say active scene active scene meaning the plot that is there on the screen it has been created for the CFD1 fan A project so since I have checked the CFD1 fan B project once I hit compare it will actually go ahead and load that second configuration and it will create that plot for that configuration so let's see give it a few seconds here to create that plot and once the plot is created we will actually be able to compare the two side by side there we go once we get the comparison successfully completed uh, we should be able to uh, switch so it's trying to switch back to the original model now so let's let's go back to the active scene and let me just maximize this so what you get are the two plots side by side with the project name and you can compare the two uh, you can actually even double click on them and it will open up the plot in sort of its own window and you can now see uh, the maximum temperature for this is 53.8 for this case uh, it's almost the same so it gives me or sorry here it is 53.8 for here and 50 well it's the same temperature but you can see the temperature distribution in the two cases and kind of make a comparison which is the better option right hope you will like this new enhancement in SOLIDWORKS flow simulation 2013 Oh, 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 oh,